y'all. I finally got some good news. We be going through a storm. You be like, dang, like I don't deserve this. Whole time God preparing you for something bigger. I feel Just a few weeks ago, I have nothing. Imagine every single thing that I have taken away from you. Chin up, chest out. It makes me look at you too out there. Cora, drink. Chin up, drink. gang it's your girl ebony elbow back to you with another video vlog if you're new here go ahead and hit that subscribe button baby because you're gonna like it. and welcome back to my ogs today is tuesday october 3rd i cannot believe it's already october 3rd anyway y'all know what it is we're working from home trying to bring y'all vlog total daily vlogs i might not hit every day but we definitely gonna have way more vlogs than normal i just got out the shower let's get our day started i'm probably finna clean the bathroom up first we got some things to do let's see what we gotta do we got to i don't know we got some stuff to do come on y'all let me finish getting ready get dressed and yeah we'll start in the bathroom yeah i'm out of the shower i done got dressed did my <clears throat> skincare all that y'all back to Corology. like i told y'all last vlog i have such sensitive skin and me trying all this new stuff and yeah my skin i broke out like it's peeling because it's so irritated Corology never does that to me and my pores was like open so wide like i was looking at one of them videos like oh my skin look bad I don't even know why I was looking like that on the video because it really don't look like that on person. That's why I need my um camera bag. It was looking, it was looking cray cray in the video. I've been vlogging off my phone since my camera being broke. So anyway, um, my skin do not look like that in person, y'all. I don't know what been going on, but it is kind of like, like I said, peeling and stuff from <clears throat> whatever I used. It was too strong. But yeah, I'm finna start a load of clothes before I work on this bathroom.
bathroom is clean, spotless. Yeah, but y'all, I don't think I like this here. So I'm gonna take this out. I'm gonna move this. I'm gonna put it in my room because I don't like that right there. I thought I did, but I don't. Y'all, I just pulled these out of the garage. I had these at my old house. They from Target. I'm sure everybody's seen them. So I'm thinking about putting them right there. I don't know. I'm finna see how it look. Okay, y'all, that's how it looks. I don't know. It's kind of like all tying it together. We'll see. I do want to put play on the gold a little bit. So I'm going to have to put something gold up here or something. I need to play on the gold. But that's how that look right now. I'm trying to repurpose everything. So we could just save money. Yeah, y'all know I'm out here by myself. So, yeah, I'm just trying to repurpose whatever I can. And I had a lot of stuff. Y'all know the other house was huge. So, I had a lot of stuff in the other house. Speaking of the other house, y'all, I finally got some good news. Ooh, let me show you. Okay, so, y'all see this? That says, amount to landlord, zero. Amount to tenant, 3178 y'all. I got my money back from my deposit y'all and it was nothing but god because it was a lot of stuff in that house that i ended up just saying bumpy if you was watching my vlogs i mean i did a really good job but certain stuff i just knew they was gonna charge me for like um one of the things like, it was just stuff they should have charged me for but when i did my i opted to do a walk out so when i did my walk out with the guy it was the same guy that did my walk in and um he he ended up he he had a story like my son Katie's and I was talking to him about Katie and showing him the pictures and the hospital and stuff like that. And I think this is what I think, because I know I owe these people money. I thought I was gonna at least get like fifteen hundred. I think that, you know, and I told him my story about what's going on. I was downsizing, I'm by myself now. Woo, woo, woo. I think that man did not charge me everything. Like it's still some good people in this world. I really think that man did not charge me the full price. I ain't no thing. I know he didn't. All they charged me for was a carpet cleaning, y'all. It was more damage to the house than just a carpet cleaning. Like it was, um, it was just, it was like, we, of course we weren't like, we weren't no horrible tenants. Like we ain't just, you know, but it was stuff that I just knew I was going to be charged for. And I wasn't. And I'm just so grateful. I wish I had his phone number. I even rolled back through the neighborhood to see if I saw him to tell him thank you. But I'm so grateful. Because that was a high deposit. They charged, you know, no matter what type of credit you had, they charged you the rent, which was $2,600 plus more for the deposit. I don't know if it's because, like, when we all moved in those houses, they were brand new. Now I notice they dropped the rent. The rent is cheaper. It was twenty six. It's when I looked online now it's twenty two hundred and it's only in one time to so deposit, you know, based on your credit. So I was like, wow. But anyway, I'm so grateful for that, y'all. Like, yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna buy us a sectional with this. I think um in Florida they have to give you your money back within thirty days today, the third. I moved out on the seventh. I mean just checking that mailbox. Matter of fact, we finna go check that mailbox now. But yeah, speaking of good people, y'all, also, um, a friend of mine, she watches my YouTube videos. Um, her name is Tara, and we went to school together. We haven't seen each other in years, and when she seen my story, she was like, what's your Zell? I want to see you something. This was a few weeks ago, y'all. This was when I was really, really down bad, and she didn't even know I was down bad. Like, y'all, I was down bad. Like, me trying to pay all these rent at my shop. This is when I was still in the other house. So I was paying rent at my shop, rent here, rent. I had to pay first month deposit here and rent, plus rent at the old house, plus just trying to feed my kids back to school clothes. I was down bad. She didn't know that, y'all. She zelled me, and she sent me all her logins so that I wouldn't have to pay a cable bill. Like, come on, y'all. Like, that really made me cry. Like, it is some good people still in the world. Like, she's I already had Netflix, but like she, I think it was like HBO Stars. She sent me all her logins so that I could watch TV. And I haven't used them yet, but it's just the principle of the fact that she offered to do that. And then she just sent it over. Like, that was so nice. Not only that, she sent me Zelle. Like, Mm, no, y'all. Like, 
I never do anything in life to get anything in return, but I know I'm a good person. I always give back. And sometimes you could be going through a storm. You'd be like, dang, like I don't deserve this whole time. God preparing you for something bigger. I feel like had I not went through this situation with my husband, my YouTube audience wouldn't be growing as quickly as it has. And I went in, even though I've always been independent, I've, I've owned homes, had homes built. I've always been codependent on my spouse as far as like never being by myself so it's just everything been a learning experience so what the devil meant for bad god meant for good and it's a lot of good even though some bad came out of the situation it's a lot of good came out of the situation even i ain't gonna keep rambling let's go to this mailbox and see if it's checking out Dang, it wasn't in there, y'all. But that's okay, because I know it's coming. To be honest with you, I don't even really know what time the mail run here. So the mail might have not have even ran yet, but we know it's coming. It's like 4 o'clock, and I'm just about to eat lunch. I'm about to eat one of my salad things. So, yeah. So this how it turned out. It looks good. And that is more than enough for me. I can't wait to taste it. At my mom's house, and look what she got me, y'all. This one of me, her, and my sister used to drink this all the time. Tomorrow, my sister's birthday. Yes, and she got the big one, the big boy. Pour up, drink, headshots, drink. I'm in Home Depot and I got the piece that's supposed to go on the drill because last time I got so many wrong things. Hopefully this work because I need this to hang them on bookshelves. So let's see. So they had a restock and I think I like this. I think I like that. It's cute. Mm, let's see, guys. These are cute. Is this the theme you're going for? It's cute. Mm -hmm. If that's your style, it's cute. I'm back home. I end up getting this picture because I like it. And then I got this Cameron wanna tie I don't know what heels. And I got this tray to go in my bathroom. I done changed my mind again. Child. Okay, we're in Walmart now. We're about to get some pumpkins. So I want to find one with a good. This one pretty good. I already got a white one in the buggy. Well, on this one. And that one. And I want these. I don't know. We'll come back and see if I want those. We just get, need to get a few groceries and um, some more fall decor. You know, groceries are essential. So, yeah, just trying to rack up on what I need. Okay, y'all, we 
back home um from walmart got my groceries i think y'all saw the total was 152 so basically um as entrepreneur as entrepreneur for my type of business um the janitorial service as y'all know the shop not bringing in any money right now i don't have a mechanic there it's not open we still have it it's just not open i'm um, trying to maintain it until my husband comes home so i'm not bringing in any money from the shop but i am bringing in <clears throat> money from my janitorial service and i picked up some extra contracts so as y'all see, like I be going full throttle because I know like a lot is doing first of the month. So I have my rent, my shop rent, um, insurance for the businesses and things like that. So we um, normally get paid once a month and that's at the first of the month. So that's how I'm able to do all the stuff I've been doing. So yeah, um, get out. so what I basically do is I pay my rent, pay the shop rent, Make sure I have groceries. I'm trying to meal plan my um, meals for the week. I'm starting to start back cook consistently because it saves me money. And then most of the time when I cook, it'll last for two days. So I'll, I'm writing out what I want to cook for the week. And then I'll go buy those meats. I, my kids have to take a lunch. So I buy that lunch stuff and just enough stuff to last me through the week, you know, to get through. And um, I fill up my tank. Um, of course, that don't last. But I fill up my tank, make sure all my bills paid. Um, and then so not only I get that check, but I'll get a check from my regular payroll as well. So I'm kind of like, I'm getting the hang of it. Like, I'm so farther than I was. Babe, just a few weeks ago, I have nothing. Imagine every single, single dime you have been taken away from you. And you literally have to start over from the bottom. I did that. So yeah, um, I'm, I, yeah, it might seem like I could say it might seem minor to y'all, but it's major to me. So I'm so glad that like I got my head above water, like the water's still right here, but my chin up, chin up, chest out. Hey, so I'm gonna show y'all what all I got. Um, my son came home from school today, y'all, and he said he wanted to cut his dreads off. And y'all know he had brain surgery, so he does have a scar right here that he's very self-conscious about. And he wants to grow a full head of dreads because it's shade on the side. So we kind of explained to him, well, to grow the full head, you need to start over, let it all grow evenly. So he came home today and he said he ready because at first he did not want to part ways with his hair. He came to me. I'm, start, I'm letting him make his own decisions because he is, he about to be 11 in a couple months. So, um, you know, decisions that are life changing so um his hair his choice he wants to cut it off so we're gonna cut his hair off so yeah let me show y'all what i got so this is basically everything i got i got these for the kids like just to snack on if i'm busy or something and can't cook or kaden likes to grab a snack when he comes home from school just some make some more salad they love these little snack cakes and pies a red um pepper cam loves these apples I'm doing chicken. I'm doing shrimp fried rice tomorrow. We got some cheese. I'm doing, I already have the fish. I'm going to do like a fish and grits with the, um, a cream sauce. This is stuff for school. I got Lunchables for them to last for ne all next week. So they have enough to last, um, all next week. Snacks to go at their lunch. Um, bacon and salmon for me. Salmon. I know I'm not supposed to put the L. Some cheese, their chips for their lunch, um, bread and some water. I wasn't really that low on stuff. I just needed to re up a little bit, and then I'll probably do like Trader Joe's this weekend. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and oh y'all, I did get two packages. Hold on. So this is my um Curology re up. <clears throat> they send it to you once a month, but you can stop the subscription because it really does last you over a month. So I pushed my subscription back this month. So it's kind of late. I don't to get it like in the beginning. So for mine, you can choose what you want in it. For mine, I do the I do the cleanser, the prescription um treatment, and then a moisturizer. That's what comes in mine. I used to do the um lip chap, but I have so much I don't really need it anymore. And then I got a package from Amazon. Let's see what this is. Oh, Lord, can I get it? Okay, hold on. Okay, let's see what this is.
got a missing order too. It's the same thing. Oh, these are my facial sponges, y'all. Y'all know these. I just put them under the water. They come compressed like this, and you just put them under the water, and they turn into a sponge. I want it white to put in my bathroom. Y'all know I'm real anal like that. So, and then I like this little holder. Just the top fit on my way. Well, how did it go? Uh huh, nah, because this was almost $30. Why is this top not fitting? Oh, okay, there you go. So, you just pull it out like that. That's easier. And I think that's cute. So I done missed an order too. So I guess I'm good to go for a while. And I still got the peoples. So yeah, I'll list that in the link below. And it'll be on my Amazon storefront. Oh, and these are the shoe boxes, y'all. So y'all remember when I, on my moving vlog, my husband's shoes couldn't fit because here's size, he's a size 14. So I ordered some that go up to a 14 and a half. He's a 13, 14. So y'all can definitely tell this is bigger. So yeah. All right, let's do Kate and Karen. Mm. All right, y'all. Uh-oh, we gonna cut them off, y'all. So I bought this stuff. It's a <clears throat> scalp treatment. I bought this for him because ever since <clears throat> he had his surgery, he gets really bad dandruff. I don't know why, but he gets really bad dandruff now. So I don't know if y'all can see that, but yeah. And I be picking it. I love to pick dandruff. But anyway... Here we go. You ready, Gay Gay? You want to save them? Oh my God, I'm finna cry. Oh my God, I'm finna cry. No, just for the chill. How it's looking we cut it out so of course it got to grow back in you ain't gonna smile baby <laughs> he gotta get used to it he's not my mama i didn't know it was gonna look like that but it'll grow but his hair grow fast i'm gonna put i'm gonna keep putting oil on it every day so i can grow fast all right baby you go take it off anyway y'all this is what i end up doing i changed it again so i got this tray from ross earlier i just put some whitewash cloths and i like this better a little more because i wanted to play on that gold i had to add some gold so i like that better y'all let me know what y'all think i just think that looks better and as y'all can see we did not get to those bookshelves it's been a busy day so don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see y'all in tomorrow's vlog so even though i'm vlogging every day y'all might not get it every day i may compile two compile two days and i'm trying to do like every other day because i want to give people time to catch up on the vlogs and i'm busy y'all know i'm busy but anyway i hope y'all are enjoying vlogs so well don't forget to like comment and subscribe love y'all again mm -hmm.